Wilson is the man. <laughs> Somebody want that Eddie? Money will make you rob. Even steal from your job. G Mom, what's good? Hey, right, I need your help. I need him out of here. Who? Who you think? Uncle Eddie? He what? don't he, he don't he don't cook for himself? He he don't clean up? He won't do nothing. He expects me to do everything. So I can't you... I, I'm just too old for this. Go watch your step. I just had to show you this gorgeous backyard that I showed your missus earlier this week. Thank you so much for accommodating my Oh, schedule. absolutely. No problem. No problem whatsoever. So, so what you want me to do? Get your boys. You hear what I'm saying? Get him out of here. You know what I'm talking about. Say less. Yes, discuss it and then I'll be right back with you guys. Okay. Okay? All right. What? Hello? Hello? Charlie? Lots of sex and alcohol But then they get what they want They take things too far What good would it be For a man to gain the world Lose his life in return For his soul For the soul For the money People want their cash Think about dinner. Auntie, don't nobody cook like you. You think so? <laughs> yes, ma'am. Not even my mama. Oh, that is so sweet. <laughs> Give me a hug. Mm -hmm. Now, that is why you Auntie's favorite niece. <laughs> Besides the fact that you agreed to come and help me do some yard work today. <laughs> <laughs> What? What? What is that? I don't know. Um, give it to me. Um, uh, I'm gonna keep this now. No! Yeah! Mom, give it back! Yeah, I'm keeping this. No! Girls. Um, hey auntie, what, what is this? That right there is something that's very, very dear to my heart. Um, how so? Well, it belonged to a good friend of mine, and it was given to me to remind me that God has my back, no matter what I go through. And the auntie's been through a lot. 
I'm sorry to hear that, Auntie. But, um, what does EW stand for? That was my friend's initials. Listen, looks like you really like that, right? Yeah, I really do. I'll tell you what. If you promise to keep it and take good care of it, it's yours. <laughs> really? Really. <laughs> and if you hold it close, you'll always know who's in charge and you'll never be worried about anything. How about that? I'd like that a lot. <laughs> Thank you, Auntie. You're so welcome, sweetheart. <laughs> now, put it up. Okay. And we are going to finish getting these flowers in this dirt. Oh, yeah. Okay? This one, a bit far down in there. Okay. Push the soil in there real good. You're doing pretty, pretty good at this, girl. <laughs> Am I? Yes, you are. <laughs> Have you come over again? <laughs> Probably be dodging me then, huh? <laughs> <laughs> no, no way, Auntie. <sighs> Miss Washington, you can take a look at this. This is your aunt's file. Get settled here for a second. I was in the VIP wing of our hospital. You understand. Uh, okay. Put Leontay on the phone. I said put Leontay on the phone. None of your business. Just put him on the phone. Hey, did you pick up Taekwondo from the babysitter? You ain't pick him up? I told you when I left the house this morning that you had to pick him up this afternoon. What is you doing? No, you supposed to pick no, you supposed to pick him up today. Now you gonna have to go up there and I'm gonna have to pay all these late fees. I ain't paying no late fees. That's why you supposed to put the money in my account on the first and the fifteenth. If you ain't putting nothing in there this month, then you ain't gonna I ain't paying for nothing. No, you finna go up there. No, you finna do you finna, I'm finna hang up this phone on you. I bet you I will. I bet you I will. Bye. <clears throat> Where were we? Uh so Doc. What does all this actually mean? Oh, Miss Washington, I'm afraid your aunt is going to... Uh-uh-uh. Don't be. <sighs> Don't be what? Don't be afraid. Miss Washington, that's just a figure of speech. Mm -hmm. I know exactly what it is, and it's a figure of fear. Listen, Dr. Stevens, you know I love my auntie with my whole heart. And she's a woman of God, a true woman of God. And she taught me at a very young age to never, ever speak with fear. And me being a woman of God myself, thank you, Jesus, hallelujah, I will not be falling for the trick of the enemy. So please, don't be speaking fear up in here. It upsets me. The trick of the what? Enemy. You're getting a little deep, aren't you? I was just trying to say that I think your aunt's heart condition requires an additional surgery. Uh, another surgery? She just had one last year. Correct. And that procedure was perfectly fine for that time. But since then, things have gotten worse and she needs to go under the knife again. Okay, uh, okay, well, what are we waiting for? Let's do it. Hmm. Well, it's not that simple. Last year when she underwent surgery, she was backed by a government program that provided 100% insurance. Since then, there's been a situation with the government funding and they're providing zilch. I, I don't understand. Is that a new insurance no, program or something? No, I mean, what? Well, yeah, if it's the kind where they don't cover nothing. What? They ain't giving you jack, okay? Jack, zero, zilch. Nada. Okay, what other I words get can it. Think? Okay. How could that even be, though? I mean, but you know what? I don't even care. Just tell me how much it is. If I got to go in my own pocket for my favorite aunt, I'll do that. <laughs> 250000 250000 what? Dollars. You know, those little green pieces of paper that you use to buy stuff? How in the world are we supposed to come up with that? <laughs> we? 
I'm a doctor, so I can blow off 250 thou in a few days and cause no problems. Mm. I suggest you do the best you can with whatever you've got to get whatever you can get. What? Miss Washington, when you let yourself out, can you please make sure you close my door? You broke people tend to leave behind an aura that leads other broke people into my office, and I don't like it. Ta-ta. Last try for you.com. Show me what you working with. Send me a man. Mm. What a fine piece of man. Now, Lord, if you was to bless me in my season of age with such a hunk of chocolate, Jesus, I wouldn't know what to do. <laughs> but I'd figure something out. <laughs> yes, indeed. on bed rest. I'm not gonna stay long. I just, just had to stop by and talk to you for a few minutes. So I just met with your uh, ghetto bougie doctor. You know the doctors don't have the final say, right? God does. And he's already said that you're healed. But they are trying to say that your heart is getting much, much worse. And that you need this really, really expensive surgery to take care of it. Cost $250,000. Auntie, nobody has that kind of money. At least nobody that I know. I know if I don't know anybody, you surely don't. I just... God, if you listen, I just need to know what you want me to do, because this is hard. You need to be trying to find you a man. Lord knows I am. Auntie? You what? stuff just got me. <sighs> Don't worry, Auntie. I'm gonna take care of this. Somehow, some way. I'm gonna take care of it. It's been 15 years since my Joseph went to be with the Lord. I'm getting up in age now. This will be my last try if I was to ever find a man half as good as my Joseph. <laughs> well, Lord, send him quickly. I ain't got too many more tries left. Oh, my Lord. Jesus. Is that you? 
I present to you all, Eddie. This here is your million dollar dream. <laughs> a million dollar dream? Let, let me, hear me out. All right, but uh, make it quick because your time actually ran up six minutes ago. I haven't been up here for six minutes. Well, exactly. Um, Mr. Wilson here, we, we hook him up with Mrs. Wright. They're dating, they're hitting it off really well, and within a week, bam, they get married. <laughs> No way. Okay, well, you lost me. So how does this help us? If he gets married, we give him a prize of $500,000. Five hundred thousand dollars Of which he will never get. Because he'll never find a woman that wants to marry him. You have a bachelor's in English, right? I sure do. Okay, we need you to doctor up this profile. Okay. So excellent, so smooth, okay. that no woman could turn it away. Okay. Okay, I can do that. All right. Now with the show and the ratings and all of that attention on the internet, we'll come back to us. Eddie Wilson? Uh, I would like to thank so. Oh, this, oh my god! Oh, Eddie! I've been looking for you! Oh, that's what she said. <laughs> no, I've really been looking for you! Oh, no, 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 I didn't have nothing to do with that night at the bar. I don't know nothing about no murdering. And now uh, Tyrell Jenkins, I love him like a brother, even though he took my lady back in the days. Uh, Tyrell Jenkins was a good friend of mine until he took my wife. You know, I love him like a brother. Like, like one you wouldn't want around your wife. Okay, so. I'm, I'm not talking about like that. Uh, I've, I've got an opportunity for you. Opportunity? Uh-huh. Opportunity. Uh-huh. You know, last time somebody asked me about opportunity, it involved a large plastic bag and some white powdery stuff. <laughs> about 15 or 20 years. <laughs> <laughs> no, not like that no. at all. It's a website, Eddie. A website? Uh-huh. Oh, that's like a place where spiders go to hang out? Not quite. Uh, have you heard of the internet? The internet? I got something on my neck. Come on with me. How about we go to my office? Let's go talk greatness in my office. Oh, greatness? Greatness. Well, I'm already great. All but right. We ain't got to go too far. All right. Well, come on with me this way. Uh, you want to grab your tooth? Oh, no, no. Don't worry about that. See, I was, I was going to make an omelet. And I left an egg in the car. Mm. Yeah, don't worry mm -hmm. nothing about that. I'll that's, get that's, that. That's, that's, that's new. That's new. Yeah. Uh, a lot, that's of things, kind of, lot of things you don't know, son. All right. What kind of innovation we want uh, on our website? Oh, yeah. It's a date. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.
Oh, this looking for a place to stay is harder than I thought. I guess I've had it good living in my mama's house. Mmm, free food. Mmm, cable TV. I had my own bed, too. Yeah, guess I'll get used to sharing that bathroom with my cousin Clyde. I'll get used to that smell. Yeah. Oh, now wait a minute. Two bedroom. Mm, utilities included. I even got a barber shop downstairs. For two fifty. Ha! That's right up my alley. Two fifty. And you can't beat that. Hmm. Let's see. Where's the address to this place? A nice place. Two hundred and fifty dollars. I got two hundred and fifty dollars in my pocket. Hey man, you better stop playing with me, dude. We're gonna do what we do. I'm gonna get my boys, we're gonna come on over there. Who you talking to like that, man? You know me. Come on, bro. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, hey, you know. Hey, let me hit you back, man. I won't probably let you. Yeah. Grass is cut. Hey, fool, man. Give me everything you got. That walker, man, thing, empty them pockets. Well, 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 ain't nothing in my pockets but some lint. I take that too, and then it's hard. No, you ain't nothing. Hey, whatever you want. Walker, my walker. Yeah, give me this walker. I've had this walker since I can walk. You're strong for old man. Give me this walker. 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 Rob me with a water bottle. Now, do you know water bottle for you, old man? Oh, well, come on, come on. Come on. Come on. Stop it. Get out of here. Get out of here. Of the main world! Ride me over the wall. Look at that guy. I just gotta take my time. Place, Dad. Come on in. Yeah, I'm going in over there. I like that hat, man. I know I'm in. Watch the wall. Uh oh. Let me give you some theme music. Yeah. Old man walk. No, check it out. I'm glad you came here, man. Check this out. Over here we got your young bathroom. You know what I mean? Whoop. Check it out. Over here we got the kitchen where I'll be cooking up the chicken. You know what I mean? Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. Now you can just tap down on over here. You know what I mean? To the section. Welcome to Fury Top Studios, baby. Let me get some theme music. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Baby, wanna go fishing. Go to worm in the hook with the, with the book. With the... Yeah, I'm gonna ride too. I like that. I like that. Yeah, yeah. 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 You got a little flavor. Yeah. I like your flavor, neighbor. Uh, you said you had uh, in the ad in the paper said you had a barber shop. What? A uh, barber shop. Oh. Whoop. Need a cut? Yeah. No, I'm good. All day, man. <laughs> so, girl, uh, what do you think? About what? Charles, the new guy you've been seeing. You ain't told 
told me nothing about him. I've been oh, waiting. Hello. Uh, you mean Charlie, the old guy I stopped saying? Shut up. No. Okay. What happened? Yeah, I'll shut up. What? That way I don't have to tell you what happened. No, 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 no. Oh, no. Open your mouth. Hi, look at me. We're here. We're here, okay? Open your mouth because I need to hear all the juicy details. Girl, this dude was just funny. Oh, he had a bad attitude. Yo, everything about this man was bad. Oh, no. I'm talking about bad breath, bad feet, bad hair. Uh, uh, wait a minute. Hold on. I thought you told me he had a bald head. How he got bad hair? Exactly. That's what was so bad about it. He ain't had none. <laughs> I'm serious. <laughs> okay, that's petty. <laughs> no, no, that's wisdom. Girl, how you gonna take care of me? He can't even take care of his own hair. Mm. Girl, bye. Uh, bye. <laughs> Boy, bye. <laughs> bye. <laughs> oh, hold on, I gotta go. Right. Afro heads and south side nail beds. Oh, hey, babe. Yes, I did get your message. Uh huh. In ten minutes, I'll be ready in ten minutes. Okay. All right. You got me what? You got me flowers? <laughs> oh, okay. Okay. Ten minutes. I swear I'll be right out. All right. Okay. Bye. <laughs> ah! Yes, girl. He's so sweet. Oh, so sweet. Like a little genetically modified raisin or something. What? <laughs> Just eat them up. Just what? Okay, <laughs> hold on, stop. Why you ain't tell me you have a new man? Do I tell you everything that goes on in my life? Um, yes. Mm. I must have forgot. Mm -mm. How you forget something like that? <sighs> Gee, I don't know. Maybe I was too busy being with my new man. <laughs> oh, all right, Shay. I didn't mean it like okay. that. I didn't mean it like that. Okay. I'm just saying, look, you can get you a man too, okay? And it was easy. I just went to lasttryforyou.com. That's what? Tryforyou.com. And baby, when I tell you they got some fine men on there, I'm talking everything from Wyoming to Wakanda. <laughs> Woo. And my clearance was a good catch. You got a good job, okay, good car, good health. Ah, oh, honey, you got <laughs> No, I got a man, which is what you need right about now with your lonely self. I am not speak lonely. On it. I'm speak not on lonely. What you call no, it? What I'm you call not. it? I... What you call it? Huh? You ain't got a man. You always stuck in the house. I'm the only friend you got, and I'm always with my man. <laughs> so, since I do have a man, I have to get ready to go because I can't keep my man waiting. What are you? You're a big girl. You can handle it. <laughs> Love calls. <laughs> you know what? But, um, listen to what I said. Because you do not get too many chances in life, and this could be your last one. Whatever. Hey, baby. Hey, baby. Did I get any mail, sweetie? You sure did. Can I have it? Yes, here you go. That's yours. Okay. Um, baby, have you noticed for the past couple of weeks we've been receiving mail that don't belong to us? Oh, baby, you know it's that time of year. Probably got a new mail carrier. It's probably just a neighbor's mail or something. Mm-mm. No, we know our neighbors and they definitely know us. I'm looking at this name and for some reason looks so familiar. Baby, just put it on the table. I'll give it to the mailman tomorrow. Okay, all right. Um... Um, yeah, about that. It's like a little bit too much going on over here. What do you mean, too much? Uh, why don't you come over here and take a look and I'll let you be the judge. All right. Mm -hmm. Let's see what you're talking about. Mm -hmm. Wilson, Wilson. Mm -hmm. Wait a minute. Eddie Wilson? Mm-hmm. Eddie? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay, why don't I like the sound of that? Wait, 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 wait. Please, please, baby, please don't tell me that that's that no good uncle of yours. That no good uncle of yours who created the helper brother fund me page in his ex-wife's name, faked his own death, disguised himself as a preacher, and preached at his own funeral? Do not tell me that that's that uncle. I'm afraid so. That's Uncle Eddie.
My name is Nathan Wilson, Eddie Wilson's twin brother. A lot of y'all didn't know Eddie had a brother, but he did, and he do, and it's me. I miss my brother Eddie. My twin we did everything together. We stole cars. Chased Jezebels around. Did the Watusi. Did everything. Hard. I know you're in that little genie bottle, Eddie. I want to rub it three times. One. Two. I see you in that line. We miss you. So I would just like to thank everybody for coming out to my brother Eddie's funeral. Babe, did we donate like a couple of thousand dollars toward this fund me page? Sure did. Okay, so where's the money? Baby, I have no clue. Okay, well maybe you have the answer to this, Tyreek. Why on God's green earth is this man getting mail sent to our home? I don't know. Okay, well you need to find out. And you need to find out soon, Tyreek, because I'm smelling the scam all up and through here and I don't like it. Okay, I'm on it. Now, Tyreek! I said, baby, I'm on it. Trust in the Lord and do good, so shall you dwell in the land, and verily shall you be fed. Delight yourself also in the Lord, and he shall give you the desires of your heart. He shall give you the desires of your heart. Okay, that's just it, Lord. My desire is to have a good man. Why is it so hard these days? <sighs> Shoot, not even got one before me and you know she wasn't trying. Auntie is gonna have one before me. She ain't slick. How many times I caught her on that website? I ain't knowing what she up to. Last try for you dot com. <laughs> uh -uh. Nope, not me. Mm -mm. I don't do that online dating stuff. That's for desperate people, and I'm not desperate. Maybe a little needy, but not desperate. I mean, look at me. I can have any man I want. You ain't got a man. You always stuck in the house. I'm the only friend you got, and I'm always with him. My man. <laughs> I want her to at least look. Ah, okay. But it wasn't lying. This site is the real deal. Mm-hmm. I might have found me a nice little dime and make change for a quarter, baby. <laughs> Let's see, I already got me a nice dime work at the nursing home. Mm. And I got a nickel to work at the library. All I need is a dime and I'm good to go. There's a 10, five, yeah, 25. All right. Mm. Look at that bad mother. Look at that right child, I see you. <laughs> you know who's looking at Eddie. Eddie looking at you. I just got signed in and I'm getting hits like that. They didn't heard about old Eddie. <laughs> Eddie Wilson is the man. <laughs> Somebody want that Eddie? Let's see. Uh, I'm just uh, signing all of it. It's popping. That was kids say popping. It's, it's lit. Ha! <laughs> Look at me. You're all cute. I know. Give me something I don't know. Looking just like a model. 
Yeah. 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 You're right. Is this really you in the picture? Well, of course it is. As <laughs> long as you wear a magnifying glass, why you looking? <coughs> What am I doing? Eh, nothing. I'm just walking around my mansion. <laughs> doing a little redecorating paint. Yeah. Hmm. Actually, I have three. Three mansions. Uh, I have one here in Chicago. I'm too in Cali. Excuse me too. <laughs> I ain't never in Cali. Uh, California. Uh, 26 California. They let me out though. They knew that wasn't me. Uh, what kind of work I do? Uh, I don't want to tell her I steal. How's you trying to steal this car anyway, man? You gonna look at it. You steal this car, ain't nobody looking for it. Just think smarter. Just hurry up, man. Come on, man. That don't make no sense. You trying to steal a car with a toothbrush. Oh, yeah, then you really. I date myself. I'm pretty nice. Yeah, I'm real. Six. Well, really five. Uh, one of the rooms I leave empty so that my future Jezebel, no, I will go back now, I'm gonna call it Jezebel for this time, or queen of my life will have her own little prison. No, no, you're being too honest, Eddie. Uh, sanctuary. Mm. Oh, sweet, yeah. Mm -hmm. Sweet enough to give you a cab. <laughs> oh, I've been on here too long. Okay, I can't be in here all night. Good. Bye. <sighs> oh, my God. Hi. Mm, this is for you. Oh, that's so sweet. <laughs> and roses are my favorite. I figured they were. That's why I picked it up for you. Mm. Uh, you mind if I have a seat? Oh, please, of course, of course. Okay. So, did you have a problem finding the place? I mean, I know it's in the boondocks, but me and my girl eat here all the time. I just love this place. Well, actually, uh, I don't have a hard time at all. Uh, I've been here before. Well, that explains why you wanted to meet here, so. Yeah. Mm, I thought I was the only one who knew about DAs. Mm, nah. Nah. No. Nah. Wow, I, <clears throat> I'm really surprised. How so? You, um, you actually look much better in person mm. than your picture. Is that true? Yes. 
and I'm relieved. <laughs> really? Actually, yeah. Now, I didn't, I didn't say put extra sauce on the chicken. I said if you don't put extra sauce on the chicken, you the chicken. Don't make no sense. It's my first time doing this online dating thing. So, uh, I don't know. I just always thought it was a big catfishing scheme. I'm sick of all this. I don't even know why I'm here. The floor all sticky. You hear that? Huh? With you, I'm actually impressed. Well, uh, I'm actually impressed as well. What do we have here? I'm sorry. Oh, uh, you sorry? And who is this? Look like a knockoff version of me. Man, you better leave my woman alone now before I raise up on you, boy. Look, look, man, I don't want no problem. What? Your woman? You know what? I'm sorry. I have never met this man before in my life. And actually, sir, we are ready to place our orders now. Order? I yeah. got off work early so we can go on our date. Date? Yeah, you don't remember. We set it up last night. You told me to meet you at DA's. Look, look, look. Hold, hold up. I'm, I'm confused. You know this guy? What's that, going on here? No. Your guess is as good as mine. What? Hello, Simone. It's me, Eddie. Eddie? <laughs> okay, sir. I don't know who you are, but this is Eddie right here. Actually, uh, I'm not Eddie. I'm Trevor. Uh -huh. See? He done try to catfish for lay. Mm-hmm. Try to get you to think that he me so he can get you. Boy, you slick. Wait a minute. You're not Eddie? No. And you are Eddie? That's right, the one and only. Eddie Wilson. Who are you? And and whose stupid rose is this? It's mine! Trevor Lewis Hamilton Thomas. Mm. You got me out in these streets looking for you. You said you was going to the car to get my surprise. Why you gotta keep saying my whole government name after everybody know that? Bring your country oh, too. Oh, 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 you in trouble now? Oh, what a shame. Well, mm. well, now that we got to know them, let's get to know each other. Yeah, I'm an idiot. Uh, check please. Check. Oh, forget it, I'll come get it. Well, where you going? Huh? You're missing out. I got some soup in my car. Hello. Yes, this is Sister from the church, Sister Jenkins. Uh, we are raising money for the, the building fund. Yeah, we're going to build some fund. Uh, yeah, so we were wondering if you could find it in your heart to donate graciously. And, 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 and help the building fund. What do you say? Ma'am, no, I hmm? really can't. I'm not, I'm not interested right now. No, you can do it. Find it in your heart. Dig down deep. Dig down deep. Okay? Sister, I'm, I'm, I'm not interested. Please add me on the do not call list. Please. What? Now, what? Well, now, wait, 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 wait a minute. Now, it's me, Eddie. Eddie? Eddie? What? Where are you? You know what? I'm really hanging up now. Oh, come on now. Don't do that. Why not? You're crazy. And you ruined my date. Well, let's, let's keep it real now. The kids say, let's keep it 100. You know, you got to be lonely. Or you wouldn't have been on the website in the first place, baby. First of all, you don't know me, okay? And secondly, how did you get my number anyway? Look, look, I'm calling to apologize. For lying to you about the way I looked. Mm, mm hmm. And? And when you left your phone on the table, 
I called my phone from your phone so I can get your number. And then I, then I got your address and social security number. What? You, uh, you know what? I can't even. And what else? And, uh, I'm sorry for lying to you about having three houses. Hold up, so you don't have three houses? She bought it. What, what was that? Uh, uh, no, I, I said I really got it. I just, you know, I got, I got so many houses that uh, it's hard for me to believe sometimes. Okay, well, that's great. Uh, I gotta go now. I have to get out of here and go to work tomorrow. Uh, well, let me take you. No, no, I don't even know you like that. Ah, oh, come on now. You don't know them cab drivers. But you let them take you every which way you want to go. And? So? And, eh, I feel bad about all the trouble I caused you. The least I can do is take you to work. I don't think so. Great, all right, I'll be there at 5.25 a.m. on the dock, all right? Yep, goodbye. No, hello, hello? What? Great. Mm -hmm. I can smell a perfume now. Uh, uh, I like a lion. Ah. Mademoiselle. Hi. Mm, looking good. Thank mm, you. Respectable. Smell clean. Must be using new soap. Mm. Oh. Oh, let me let me help you with your bag. Uh no. No. Sorry, I already told you I don't need a ride. My cab should be here any second now. Uh, or not. What'd you just say? Yeah, a cab was out here sitting down. I don't know what nationality. Yeah, I told him to go on head on. Now I'll take you to work. You did what? Yeah. I remember when we talked about me taking you to work? Uh, yes, but do you remember when I said no? Oh, that's what you meant now. I thought you were saying no to me not taking you to work. Hmm? Sir, no means no. Uh, it depends on the context. You know, we in the bedroom, it's late. Ew, you said okay, no, I... you're weird. I'm going to work. But, 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 how are you getting there? Walking. But, but how long is it going to take you? About an hour. Oh, no. Walking time, that's two hours, 35 minutes, and 23 seconds. With no traffic. Does he know these things? You know what? It's all right. No. It's all right. Fine. Yeah. I'll just call me another cab. Well, you can't call. Uh, uh, I called him. This house right there burned to the ground. Wasn't nothing left but cats and tea bags everywhere. What? Yeah. I try to be prepared. You know, my mom always told me, be prepared, you know. So I prepared myself just in case you didn't want to ride. And then I prepared myself to make sure you ain't had no other options. That is the dumbest thing I've ever heard. Literally! Mm. Oh my god! Mm. Yeah. You know what? Fine. Yeah. Fine. Yeah. This just because I am late to work. Yeah. But that is the only reason. But let me tell you something. Get me to work. Well, I'm gonna get you. Yeah. And if you try anything, and I do mean anything, mm. I'll mess your face so bad, you'll fall in love with the smell. Mm. Got it? I'm actually turned on right now. <clears throat> Listen, All right. Good. 
Well, come on. Don't take the meekness for weakness. Uh, uh, well, take it, let you get it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's a good sock. Disgusting. No. The sock got history. Ugh. It's a good sock. Just yeah. got some stains it's holding on to. So, this is your ride, huh? Yeah. Well, I actually borrowed this. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, I borrowed it. Uh, <laughs> my other car's in the shop. Yeah, I'm getting plush carpet and. We need a coffee maker putting it back and foot massages for my gas pedal. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but enough about me. Where are we going? Oh, uh, downtown. You're going to make a right up there. Downtown? But not before we pray. What, what you got to pray for now? You already got the job. Yes, I know I already have the job, but... I always pray before I leave home. That's just my way of making sure I get there safely. Uh, I got a little something. Make sure I get where I'm going safely, too. Uh, 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 uh you know what? Yeah. You are real special. Just, <laughs> can you please lead us in prayer? Uh, yeah. Okay, sure. You do know how to pray, right? Uh, yeah. yeah, I know how to pray. I, I grew up in the church. <clears throat> <clears throat> Maybe bow our heads. Now I lay me down to sleep. I pray the Lord my soul to keep. For what good is the world? A man who gains the world loses his soul. For this day, you give us our daily bread. We walk by faith and not by sight. That's my favorite scripture to read when my bills come in the mail. Lord, let these checks clear in your name, for mine will not do. Amen. Hello, Eddie? 
Hey, yeah, it's Simone. Oh, okay, listen, I, I was actually thinking, um, how does tomorrow night sound? Okay, great. Yeah. Well, just, just text me the address and I'll be there. Uh, calm down. <laughs> okay. All right. See ya. Hey, get that money, girl. Get that money. Oh. oh. Can I help you? Oh, can I help you? answer to that is yes. No. Better question. When do you want me to Ooh. help you? Oh, never. What, what's going on, baby girl? This old man at the door trying to flirt with me. I don't want to flirt with you. Yes, you were flirting. What? I opened the door and he just standing there looking at me like I'm a piece of meat. Now, come on, man. That's when you're lying. Really? Now, I'm a vegetarian. I don't even eat meat. Oh, God. Baby girl, that's your Uncle Eddie. Oh. You ain't seen him since you was a baby. He look at young girls all the time. Yes, I do. Disgusting. Mm. Baby, go on back upstairs and finish cleaning your room. Yeah, Uncle Eddie, come on in here, man. Right. Come on in, huh? Come on in here. Put the door a little tight. Come on, can you make it? Come on in. Come on now. Come on in. Come on. Come on. Big. Come on. I got you. I got you. I got you. Yeah. <laughs> My back. I, I see. Uh, come on, man. How many times you done changed today? You uh, only changed two, three times a day. Yeah, thanks for noticing. This is my third outfit. <laughs> so can I get you something to drink, Uncle Eddie? Uh, yes. Uh, lemonade and vodka. Lemonade coming right up. Oh, what you asking for? And what you come by my house for anyway? Somebody die? You owe somebody money? Or the people you owe money, you're running from. You need a couple of dollars. Oh, come on now. Every time I come over here, you think I want something. Because you do. Nah, I'm offended. All I done done for you? Come on, that's your Uncle Eddie. Your, your, your daddy's oldest brother. Your only living uncle. You my only uncle, period. Mm, you got a point. Well, come on, all I done done for you. Remember that time your mama got hit on that bicycle and the wig flew off? I got the wig for you. I want you to have that momentum. Huh? Brought you under my wing, treated you like you were my own. Half the time, I thought you was mine. Wait, what? 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 No, 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 don't worry about that. Now, me and your mama got a little history. And yeah, we went to prom together. Night to remember. Oh, I don't want to hear this. Look, I don't want to hear that. Oh, we went to prom. Uncle Eddie. Well, all right, well, that's not the point. Now, this is your Uncle Eddie now. All I done done for you your whole life, this is thanks I get. You know what? I apologize. You're right. I'm tripping. I was wrong. What's going on? What brings you over here? How can I help you, Uncle? Uh, uh. Oh, yeah, I need to borrow your house. Say what? Borrow my house? Yeah. Uncle Eddie. Do you hear how you sound? I can see if you want to borrow my car or some money. Hey, I even give you the, the shirt off my back. How is it even possible for me to borrow you my house? Very possible. You get your pretty little family together. Y'all going out to the show. Get you one of them meals or something. I move in. Okay? Now, nah, don't worry about it. It ain't going to take too much time. Three, four hours, oh, I'll be out here. I cannot be late. Now, if this was her event, she would have been ready last night. Ladies, let's go. Come on now. I can't be late for this event. It's an important night. Come on now. We're coming. We're coming. Come on. You can take the time. <laughs> Look at that. The two most beautiful women in the world. Mm, mm. Thank you. Mm. So you guys ready to go do We're this? We're ready. I'm ready. Let the games begin. Thank you. Thank you, love. Ladies first.
how much? 90. I'm sorry, what? 90. 90? 50 for the trip, 40 for being in the ghetto. Are you serious? I'm dead serious. You know what? Here, that's all I got. That's all you're getting. That's it? Yes. You're Sir? cheap! Give me the rest of my money, you cheapo! Just give me a chance to prove my love. Cause you're like an angel to me. Sent from heaven above. Hmm. Oh, it's time. <coughs> So long. Uh, well, I would have been here sooner if he had given me the right address. Hmm. It's uh, 3647, not 3746. Huh. How you not on your own address? Well, I'm trying to just move in. Yeah. What, today? Uh, no, no, anybody moved in today. Come on in here, okay. sweet thing. Put that door up for me. <clears throat> Come on in. Get the dough for you. Yeah. All right, so uh, uh, and I'll get you something to drink. Uh, water's fine. Water? Thank All you. Right. Yes. Go get your glass. Uh huh. Uh, -uh. Mm -hmm. uh Eddie, 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 Eddie. Yeah. Forget the water. No. It's fine. I'm not no, no. No, no. Okay, well, come on in and uh, make yourself comfortable. Okay. Take your clothes, your, your coat, your coat off. Right. I'm gonna help you. Oh, oh. Mm -hmm. Thank you. <clears throat> Eddie, this is a um, nice house. It's not quite the mansion that you described. Yeah. But so how long have you been here? Uh, probably about three years. Oh. Yeah, but I'm I'm hardly here. Uh, I'm normally at my other two houses. Yeah. Wow. You are really incredible. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I mean, just think. You uh, got all this money, all these homes. Mm -hmm. And you only work as a waiter. Yeah. <laughs> Imagine how much money you have if you actually had a real job. No, oh, mm -hmm. you don't think I really work at DAs, do you? No, it's not my job. It's, it's a part of my job. It's a, it's a secret assignment. Uh, yeah, I work for the for the, the Secret Service. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Mm -hmm. What kind, of, what kind of work is that? Oh, it's a secret. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I got it. That's a good one. That's a good one. I kill you. <laughs> <laughs> ah, I got it. Wow. Mm -hmm. well, I actually have a secret of my own. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But uh, we'll wait until a little bit later to share that. Oh, okay. Yeah. So, uh, what you what you want to do? You want to um, watch a movie or something? Uh, sure. What you got? Hmm, what I got? What do I have? Yeah. Uh, well, uh, it's hard to say. It's been so long since I watched a movie in this house. You know, because uh, I'm used to that other one. Yeah, well, you know, I'll be right back. Let me, let me go to the bathroom. Oh, okay. Uh, can, you, can you make it? You oh, yeah. Good? Let me see it.
You good? Yeah. Get around. Ah. Hmm. Uh, whose pictures are those? Oh, what pictures? Yeah, these. These right here, face down. Oh. And. Oh. Who they? So you uh, you met them, huh? Met who? My uh, my my adopted family. That's right. Uh, one day I was riding around town in my limousine, and uh, I saw these. Two people living under a bridge downtown. It was, it was pitiful. Mm -hmm. They reeked of urine. I said, you know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna adopt them and bring them into my home. And I, I did that. I, I adopted them and I, I brought them here. And I told them, I said, you know what? Y'all can live here as long as you want. Mm -hmm. You know, or until you get your, 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 yourself together. <laughs> I washed that urine off of them, and then everything's been good. Is that right? That's right. And they here all the time. You know, that's why they pictures us up there. But they here so much, sometimes they got to, they got to let me in, you know, because my key. Okay, Eddie. I Eddie, stop. Key, you know. Stop. Okay. Just don't. Just. <laughs> this is not your house, is it? Well, why would you say that? Um, well, let's see. Um, you don't know where anything is. Okay, because <laughs> I doubt if the kitchen is upstairs. <laughs> then uh, you gave me the wrong address, and you don't have any pictures of yourself anywhere. It's these good people. Well, yeah, you're right. Uh, yeah. This is not my house. <sighs> this is my nephew's house. Mm -hmm. Why would you lie? Well, I figured if, if I didn't have all the things that a, a beautiful woman such as yourself would want, I, I would think that you, you, you would think I couldn't afford you. Uh, afford me? <laughs> afford me? I'm sorry. I, okay. Well, you know what? Let me put your mind at ease. There is not no amount of money in the world that could afford me. Mm. It couldn't buy my love. You know why? Well, why? Why don't you come over here? Come over here. I'll tell. Uh, you heard of Jesus, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh. Mm. Oh. oh. Okay. Well. Um. I actually believe that my love is built on the love he shared for all of us. Mm. He shared with all of us. Mm. I mean, that's priceless. I mean, you can't buy that. Mm -hmm. and all this material stuff is just temporary. It's not permanent, but true love is. Mm. Yeah. yeah. You're right. Mm -hmm. That's deep. You're a deep <laughs> sister. <laughs> so, uh, Yes, I messed up, you know. I messed up big time. I guess you, you know, go and get out of here. You, you ready to go, huh? As a matter of fact, I am. Mm. But not before we finish watching this movie, so. Mm. So you still want to watch the movie with me? Oh, uh, yeah. I mean, why not? You went through all this trouble just to get me over here, so you may as well finish where you left off. So no. let's do it. Mm. Alright, okay, well, hey, hey, don't get too comfortable. You're still in the doghouse. Just letting you out for a little while. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Alright, baby. <laughs> now take it easy. <laughs> baby steps. Google <laughs> Gaga.
boss? Yeah, yeah. No, I'm looking for him right now. Yep. Um, no, I don't. I don't know where he is. But wait, what was that? You said the internet. The internet. You said the website's been getting more hits. Yeah, great. I mean, that's that's exactly what I was talking about. And this is just the beginning. I mean, you wait. Wait until she dumps this Negro. <laughs> the internet's really gonna be buzzing. That's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. All right. Yeah, I gotta go. Okay. Dang. Uh, Eddie, where are you? Oh, buddy, old pal. How's it going? Oh, okay. Uh, How's the dating life? Oh, uh, great. Wait, maybe you didn't hear me. I said, how's the dating life? You know, with the beautiful young lady from the internet? Yeah, um, uh, I heard you perfectly well, uh -huh. and it's going well. Going beautiful. It is? Yep. I thought she dumped your dirty self the first time she saw you. Yeah, I think she wants me to meet her parents soon. You! She wants you to meet her parents. She wants the parents to meet you. Yep, it's going wonderful. <laughs> okay. That's great. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, in a couple of days, I'm going to be a very rich man. Very rich. Very rich. Now, I want you to get the name right on that check. That's Eddie Wills. Wills. Okay. Because there's an Eddie Jackson over there in that nursing home, and he already got enough money. All right. Wills. Got it. Like, I will have some money. I will cash the check. Got it. Wills. All right. Long now. New tennis balls in this walker. Might buy a new bat. Come on up, up. In here. I need to hear everything about this new guy. Okay, I still don't understand why you got popcorn. <laughs> Girl, cause you got a man. <laughs> Shoot, that's like watching the movie all by itself. Whatever. And what's the remote for? Just in case I have to press stop, pause, and play. What? You know what? Look, it's really not that serious. It Trust is. Me. It so is. Okay, well. He's very intelligent. Uh -huh. You know, street smart. Uh -huh. Does he look good, though? Is he fine? Because <laughs> you know my motto. If he ain't a 10 or above, he gets no love. <laughs> All right? If he ain't someone you want your girls to meet, Tell that brother to have several seats. <laughs> mm. Well, mm -hmm. he's a good storyteller. Mm. Is he fine though? Girl, look, you know with me, it ain't never been about the looks, you know? Pause! Who do you think you fooling? You the same one that broke up with your last boyfriend because he had a bald head. It don't get no more savage than that. Mm. Well, actually. Wait, hold on. I didn't press play yet. Okay, now you can talk. Okay. <laughs> well, I got something to tell you about that. Okay. Come on. Okay. About the ex. Mm -hmm. <sighs> he actually broke up with me. Ah! Yes, and I know I lied. I'm savage. sorry I did. Yes, he is a savage. But girl, I was in denial. Uh -huh. Shoot. I think I still am. Uh huh. But I'm a good woman. You are? I am a good you woman, are right? So You're Wow, okay. Yeah. You are, girl, fabulous. Dude, I don't deserve to be broken up with. And I'm the breaker up. Yes, that's I don't do. get broken up you with. You right about that. So forget oh. him, okay? He didn't know what he had. Hmm. And we'll just pray that some woman, you know, finds him and be able to handle his bald head butt. Hmm. About that bald head. <laughs> what? Did he have hair? <laughs> 
like the king of the jungle. <laughs> She was bald. Shoot, he'll be that much uglier. Hater. Ugly. Are you such a hater? I wish he was. He was so much uglier. <laughs> anyway, I don't want to think about him no more. We back to the future. Mm -hmm. Okay, true, now true. where was I at? You were telling me just how unattractive your new man is. He's not unattractive. Yeah. He's just not, you know, sexy. Yeah. That's unattractive. But go on. Whatever. Okay. <laughs> like I was saying, he's, um... He's a little bit older. Okay, well, that's okay. I mean, what? Mm -hmm. We talking 37, 38, mm. 41, 42? Girl, that ain't a problem. I dated a guy once that was 45. Really? He was real cool, actually. Oh. Mm -hmm. Well, what happened? Nothing. I just found out he was married with children. <gasps> Ooh. It was so ratchet. Girl, I felt like I was on the actual show. You know what Ew. I mean? But mm. anyway, so how old is he? Um, 67. 60 who? Seven. <laughs> he got insurance? Why? I don't <laughs> know. That's something you need to know. Girl, people are dropping like flies, okay? You need to position yourself to get a couple of more dollars you know in your what? pocket in case he kicks the bucket. Ah, uh, you are so it's wrong. Whack. I cannot do you. Okay, okay. You, okay. I, you know I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Mm -hmm. Not really, but um, <laughs> <laughs> look, look, you got a picture of him. Can I see a picture no, at least? No, no. Come on, you got me anxious over here. You don't know how to behave. I'm Come not showing on. you no picture. I want to see what mm -hmm. the man look like. I'm a little anxious over here. I'll, I'll behave. I'll behave. I swear. Okay. Okay. But like I was saying, he is very, very right simple, right you know, right and, you know, with a little work. He's Come on, run that. Okay. Run it. Okay, here. That girl. Okay, light up. He is not that ugly. Shoot, you acting like he's... Stop. He... Girl. This is Eddie Wilson. You know him? Who don't know Eddie Wilson? Are you serious right now? Um, no, I didn't know him. How do you know him? You mean to tell me you don't? I do not know him. Mm, okay, um... How you know him, though? For real, because we know him. I gotta go. I gotta go. And Where I'll, you going? I'll talk to you later about this. I swear. What? I promise you I'll talk to you later about Nadia. this. Okay? I will Where you are you going? You are bugging, Nadia. How you gonna make all this popcorn and not... Yeah. Definitely. No, definitely. Yeah, no, I think that's a brilliant idea. No, uh, you know what I think with the, uh, well, yeah, with the success we're having right now, I think they're just, we're not going to run into any of these problems anymore. No. Oh, all right. There he is. That's what I'm talking about. The man of the hour. My man. Hey. Oh, hey, want a cigar? No, sir. Okay. Well, oh, hey, ditch the sir. Huh? Okay. Um, are you sure? Really? Oh, yes. Of course. You know what? You're, uh, you're more like a partner. No, oh, a good friend. A brother. Mmm. <laughs> are you sure? Last week you said you wished I was dead. Yes, I did. Uh-huh. But that was last week, you know? And it's like, this week, I don't know. It's like you died. But then, you rose again! <laughs> All right. <laughs> okay. Are you, are you sure? Right. Yeah. So, tell me. Oh, buddy. <laughs> what brings you into uh, your brother's office? That's the thing. Uh, huh? It's about Eddie Wilson. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, my man. Eddie Wilson. Now, that's what I'm talking about. Yeah. <laughs> How's your old moneymaker doing? Well, huh? So, so that's the thing. Um, mm -hmm. uh, well, um, brother. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, uh, I don't think she's going to say no. Yeah. <coughs> what? Yeah, I think I think she's gonna say yes. It's <coughs> looking like she's gonna say yes. <coughs> what do you mean? She's not gonna say no? Oh, man, you, 
You mean this bum is going to get married before me? I'm in pretty bad shape. I can't get a woman to save my life. And I own a dating company. Oh, God, I should have known. My mother, when I was in the 12th grade, she had to pay my, my auntie's daughter to go to prom with me. Well, that's bad. Shut up! Man, no, didn't anyone ask you anything? James, that was just... That's that. sir to you, dead man! Okay, sir. Um, all I was saying was, what are we gonna do about the money? Money? The money? What money? You know, the the money for the, the girl. He's got the girl, the $500,000. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. What? <laughs> oh, yeah. oh, there ain't no $500,000. What? 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 Oh, man, I've only got 500,000 pennies. No, no, don't you think if I had $500,000, that, well, you would be making a whole lot more money now, wouldn't you? You know, the whole point of this program was that he didn't get the money. But no, you had to go out and find someone who was actually charging. I know. So, what are we going to do? Well, I don't know what you're going to do, but... I'm getting ready to pack up and ship out. As soon as they find out what kind of scam we were trying to pull here, they're gonna be after the both of them. Or rather, they're gonna be after the both of you Me? because I'm gonna get gone. And I suggest that you get gone too, boy. Uh, oh, no, no. Maurice, though, while I have the chance to tell you this, huh? I just wanna tell you. Man, get your dirty no good job having behind out of here before I kick you out. Cause then you're gonna have a dirty no good job having behind with a foot in it. Where is the boy? Is, is the boy here yet? No, baby. If he was here, you'd see him, don't you think? Well, now, now that all depends. Depends on what, Malcolm? If my eyes is open or not. Then why in the world would your eyes not be open, Malcolm? Why? Yeah. Okay, now you got amnesia or something now. You, you, you must have forgot. Okay, let me refresh your memory. Okay, thank Okay, you. the last time my daughter brought a man to this house, that man was so horrible looking, I almost went blind looking at him. Daddy, that is not You true. want to bet? Ask your mom. <laughs> she the one who took me to the doctor. It's really, true. mom? It's true. <laughs> I wouldn't have believed it myself if no. I had not been there. <laughs> Look, I don't want to hear the it. The doctor didn't even know what to prescribe. All he told me was, next time you bring home a fella, make sure I put my shades on. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's my sweet That must be him. Um, I'll get the door. All right, all right. Why you got these paper plates out here? You don't start no mess. Don't paper plates? And don't be embarrassed. And, and we got glass. This might be one. Don't you be embarrassed. You well, mean? he ain't going to be the one. He sees paper plates. Don't you say nothing to him. What, what I'm going to say? If whatever you just don't I ain't going to say nothing. You don't just don't. You get these paper plates don't out here. We, we can't got, eat on this. We just don't worry about it. We have got glasses and the paper plates. Paper napkins in the butter now. Here's Eddie. The name's Eddie Wilson. I'm from the Nigerian tribe by way of Maywood, Illinois. Mom. <coughs> Malcolm. Malcolm. Baby, could I put my glasses on now? Absolutely. Please hurry up quick.
Hey, girl. Look, first off, I want to apologize for leaving your house yesterday so abruptly, especially without any explanation. That was not cool, and I'm sorry for that. Um, it's just that I didn't know how to tell you what I'm about to tell you now. <sighs> but, uh... I don't know, after thinking it over, I feel like the best way to even break this news to you is just come out and say it. So here it goes. Girl, this Eddie Wilson guy is not who you think he is, okay? He is just a gimmick and a hoax who last tried for you.com is paying just to see if he can get someone to marry him in a week. And if he does, he will win a half million dollars. Yes. And I'm surprised you didn't have a clue. It's been all over the internet. But I guess that you're working everything, you missed it, girl. But whatever you do, look, don't fall for this clown, okay? It's a setup. And I'm sorry you had to find out like this, but that man does not love you and he's a manipulator and conniving. So whatever you do, just don't say yes. Because you will definitely regret it. Okay? All right, girl. Well, I love you, sis. And don't worry, you'll find someone one day. And call me back, okay? Bye. Said about what happened the other night. I did not want to give your dad a black eye. But come on now, you saw the man chasing me around the table like I'm a chicken and he chicken jaws. Come on now, I'm gonna tell you like I told him. I'm from Maywood, all right? From the hood. We don't play that. Anybody can get it. When were you gonna tell me? Well, I figured you'd get the hint when you opened that glove box and you saw that gun in there now. You still don't think I know, do you? Now, come on now, I just told you. Eddie, I'm talking about the $500,000. Oh, $500,000. No, that don't ring no bell. Uh -oh. I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, it doesn't ring a bell. Mm. I actually have a bell. You got a bell? Maybe it'll help. Keep a bell. Last try for you dot com. Marry me in one week. Five hundred thousand dollar prize. Is it ringing a bell now, Eddie? Huh? Is it ringing? Uh, yeah, it's definitely ringing now. Baby. Yeah, I thought it's it was. ringing now. Oh, well, come on now. Just... Let me explain what happened. You know what? I don't even want to hear it. I'm convinced it's a lot, lot worse than I could ever imagine. No. Yes. No. Yes. No. No. Yes. Ah. Uh -huh. See? Oh, play the trick on me. Mm hmm Well, I guess that makes two of us. Oh, come on now. I was going to tell you. I just couldn't figure out the right time. That's when? Fine. When? 
in the hotel room during the honeymoon? You know what? You know what? Mm-hmm. Leave. Leave. Get it and go. Come on now, baby. Get me out. Come on, sit on down, sweet thing. Now listen, now. I'm going to be honest with you, okay? Mm-hmm. Now, yes, I was in it for the money at first. Yeah, I plan on marrying you, and that was the only reason at first. But do I feel that way now? Yes. No, absolutely not. Come on now, what I wouldn't do for that half a million dollars to be in my bank account right now? Trust me, baby. I've done more for less. Now, if you ever wanted to marry me, I'd snatch your hand before you could even pull it back. You know, on the way over here, you know, I've been thinking. I really understand that, you know, a person like me, baby, don't, don't deserve somebody like you. Come on, look at me. Come on, I'm old. I'm poor. I'm homeless. Look at you. Young. Pretty. Smart. Mm. I mean, you got God in your life. Mm, come on, what more can a man ask for in a woman? Hmm? Just don't understand. You know, you're down to earth. You got, you got God in you. You know. Once I really dug in, in here. On the way over here, I dug down deep in a conversation with myself, you know. And I realized, you know, I couldn't do it. I dug down deep. I had to say no. That's right, I told him no. Telling you no, I even said no to the money. Wait a minute. You said no to the money? That's right, yep. I even went down there to tell them, uh, Last try, folks. Exactly how I feel. Went through the whole building, didn't find nobody. Really? Not a single soul. That's right. You know what? I feel a whole lot better now that I got that off my chest. Especially the money part. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, oh my God. Oh. You don't know what you just did. Oh my God, I should have known this wasn't going to work out the way I planned. Oh, That'd be so stupid. Oh, come on. Don't be so down on yourself, baby. Well, me and you can work some things down. I didn't know you felt that strong about it. I'm all game, baby. Oh, come on, no, get off of me. Who wants you? I'm talking about the whole ordeal. The, the, the money, the marriage, everything. I, I knew about it all along. Emma? Yeah. I was just playing along with it. The whole thing. Why you do that? All for the money. I'm not like that. I mean, I wasn't going to be dishonest or anything. I just I was trying to wait it out to see if I could actually fall in love with you Ooh. quickly so we could get married and split the money 50-50. Some tripped out way, I actually thought it was a blessing from God. Oh, yeah. A gift. A gift, yeah, you know, I'm God's gift to every woman now. Quit playing, I'm serious. I thought this money was an answer to my prayers. My favorite aunt, she needs this really serious surgery and it just so happened to cost $250,000 that I don't have. Mm. I was gonna use my half of money of the money to pay for it. God, my family is counting on me. Yeah, that is a problem. Mm. Of course, I'll still be stuck with you after the surgery, but mm. I didn't. No, Eddie, listen. You're a really nice guy. I was actually starting to think about the possibilities. Mm, I knew it. <laughs> mm-hmm. 
Yeah, I was. Yeah. Until yesterday when my parents came over. It was something about that moment when you were running around that table with my father that I realized that is not what I want in life. What, your daddy to have a black eye? Cause I am... No, a husband that's older than my parents. Hmm. I guess that is a little creepy, huh? You're terrific, you really are. Oh, I know. Yeah, <laughs> I know you know. But you're just not for me. Yeah. I'm sure there's someone out there for you, and I pray that it's someone out there for me, but it's just not you and me. You know what I mean? Yeah. I get your drift. Okay. Uh, why don't you go home? Ooh. Yeah, go home or wherever it is you reside. Just. Oh, right now I'm living with my mama since we're coming clean. Excuse me? Oh, yes, I'm living with my mama in the basement. Right by the wash and dry, baby. Okay. Your clothes, your clothes will never get dirty. I get it. I get it. That's good to know, mm -hmm. though. Yeah. Why don't you go back there? Go on back to your mama's house and uh, just kind of clear your thoughts a bit and see what direction God leads you. Find a good woman. Well, well, now you know. I'm here. I'm here right now. Mm. Mm. God directed me right no, into you. Oh no, 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 no. He did not. He said, I'm here now. No, no, no. So maybe God sent me in your direction. Uh no, no, I don't think so. Here, grab it, grab it, so you don't fall that way. All right. All right. All right. Yeah, yeah. Hmm, okay, that's fine. I'm down with the nickname. Don't, don't, don't watch your step. All right? No, 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 no. You got to be pushing. Now, come on. I'm just helping you out the door. I'm helping you out the door. Oh, please. You can't get to that door quickly. It ain't made for me, is it? No, it's not. It's really not. You're lost. Bye. Wait a minute. Auntie. What the? Baby girl. Hey, Ma. Girl, guess what? I just wanted to let you know. I found this cutest dress. I bought it, and I can't let your daddy know about it, though. But anyway, I didn't call you about all that. I called to see how my baby girl doing. Oh, God. I just had the weirdest dream. Really? Mm-hmm. You were in it, and uh, Daddy and Auntie Seal, and it's old guy named um, Eddie Wilson. He was uh, on this website and... Whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, what was that last name again? Wilson. Oh, wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> What's so funny? I have not thought about Eddie Wilson, that name, in, man, years. Oh, my God. Mm, what, you know somebody named Eddie Wilson? Yeah. Yo, Aunt Sylvia's first sweetheart was named Eddie Wilson. That boy was so fine. I mean, he wore these little bow ties and the suspenders and oh my God. I mean, they dated through high school. They dated through grammar school. They dated through, I think they dated in the womb. <laughs> really? Mm. That boy was so fine. You know what? If his daddy had not got this really good paying job and moved out of town, you could have been your uncle. Mm. Mm -mm. I almost married my uncle. What was that, baby? Uh, it, nothing. But you know one thing, I really think that the reason why your Aunt Sylvia has heart trouble to this day is because of Eddie Wilson. Because once they moved out of town, I mean, she just it just broke her heart. Broke her heart. And all of a sudden, she had to go to the doctor and the doctor said she had heart trouble, and then he said something about her heart was skipping beats. Mm. 
Mama always said that the only thing that um, would really, really help her would be if Jesus healed her or if Eddie Wilson came back from Alabama. Shoot, girl. I had a little crush on the boy myself. He was so cute, so fine. You know what, now that I think about it, if Eddie was back here, we wouldn't have to worry about that money because they said he made a killing. He got stanky rich out there. Uh, uh, Ma, I, somebody's at the door. Hold on for a second. Mm. Mm -mm. Yes, uh, I'm looking for uh, uh, the descendants of Sylvia Washington. I was on a website called lasttryforyou.com and they told me that, uh, yeah, uh, that they, they live here in this address. My name is, uh... Eddie Wilson. That's right, uh, Eddie Wilson. Uh, come on in. Right. I was hoping you said that. All right. Got a lot of steps here. You know, all could use a ramp. All You're my bright and shining star. Hey, and I what just want to be EW Santa. Wherever you are, that was my friend's initials. You're my winter, my summer, fall and spring. But, now, Lord, I guess if that you was the blessed thing in my friend. season age with such a hunk of chocolate, you, Jesus, I wouldn't know what to do. Doing whatever. 